Good day, Father Matt Williams here in my podcast. I hope you're doing well. All right, beginning with the end of mind on this Holy Week, we want to be saints and we're begging God for the grace to be saints. And we're looking at the letter T in the acronym for saints. And there's two for T. And the, the first one for T is totally trust or total trust in God. Yesterday, we talked about being like a little child, right? Jesus says, unless you become like a little child, you can't enter the kingdom of heaven. And Jesus wants us to be like little children, trusting in our heavenly father, trusting in the Lord, just like he trusted in the father that the Father will guide us, that He is trustworthy. So I'd like to give us three different, or reflect for you today, just three different um, passages in the Scripture that reflect this this total trust in the Lord in really seeking His will above all others. The first is uh, the Annunciation, when the Archangel Gabriel appeared to Blessed Mother Mary and asked her to become the mother of the Savior. And what was Mary's response at the end? I am the handmaid of the Lord. Let it be done unto me according to your word. In other words, Mary says, that I'm, I'm God's servant, may God's will be done in my life. So fiat, let it be done in my life. So that's Mary's response to the Archangel Gabriel. And Mary lived her whole life as one complete fiat, let it be done. Second prayer, Jesus teaches us the Lord's Prayer, right? And what do we pray in the Lord's Prayer? Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. So again, we see in the Lord's Prayer, like in Mary's prayer, we see that may God's will be done in my life. Not my will, but may God's will be done in my life. And then the third episode is in the Garden of Gethsemane, when Jesus prays, Father, let this cup pass, but not my will, but your will be done. And so Jesus, in his agony, asking that this cup would be taken from him, surrenders, says, fiat to the Father, but not my will, your will be done. So in in the Lord's Prayer, in Jesus' Prayer in Gethsemane, in Mary's response to the Archangel Gabriel at the Annunciation, we have this, let it be done. May God's will be done in my life. Not my will, but God's will. In God's will is our peace. And so trust is so important in all this because when we begin to trust in God with all of our mind, heart, soul, and strength, then we can say, Lord, let your will be done, not my will be done. And the only way that, way that we're going to be able to say that, the only way we're going to be able to grow in trust is if we pray, if we climb the mountain of prayer. Have you climbed the mountain of prayer yet today? Because the Lord is waiting for you. And on that holy mountain where you become one with God in prayer and contemplation, you too and I will say, let it be done unto me according to your word. Thy will be done. Not my will, Father, but your will be done. God bless you.